In this video, we will explain how to copy activities and relationships in Promavera. So if I have the superstructure here, first floor, I will click insert from my keyboard and have the columns rebar. Insert also. columns for work and columns concrete after that slab for work slab rebar slab concrete so for the column rebar I will make it five form work five as well column concrete one or two days like one day it's left for more and you will have it six days six days for the bar as well and the slab concrete one day and let's link them quickly so i will go to relationships choose the successor columns of form work and then go to so it will direct me to the column form work activity. Then I will link to concrete. Go to slab form work. Go to slab rebar. Go to and slab concrete. So I link it everything, but we can also have overlap between these activities. So for the column rebar, I will add another activity. So start to start and finish to finish relationship for the column rebar and the form work. So I will have here start to start, let's say one day and finish to finish one day. For column form work, after that I will have the concrete just one day casting. Slab form work, start to start one day. And also I will choose slab rebar for finish to finish relationship, lag one day. then concrete so if i want to add the same set of activities for the second floor i do not have to insert activities one by one again and do the same what i can do is i can select all activities here from all this fragment or set of activities copy and go to the second floor and click paste so it will ask me here, do you want to copy everything? Yes, I want to copy the activities, relationships as well. Because there are some intermediate links here for these activities. So it will copy it, but it will not copy any external activities. So for example, if I link, just for example, compaction to rebar. Of course, it's a wrong relationship, but I will tell you how it works. So if I will copy all these activities, it will not copy the relationship between compaction and the columns rebar. It will only copy these intermediate links. So column rebar, form work, only these relationships among these activities only. Click copy and go to the second floor and click paste. Yes, I will copy everything. Okay. You see now, so the relationships with the compaction it didn't exist but for other activities I copied as it is so it's really quick shortcut to copy activities let's remove the compaction because it's wrong so let's have after compaction let's have the foundation work and after that I will have the backfilling there should be a slab on grade as well but i will just skip that because slab on grade is not critical it can be done at later stage so for foundation work i will have 25 days for all rebar form work and concrete work backfilling seven days excavation and the convection let's have overlap five days and compaction and the foundation let's have finish to start relationship foundation I will click go to then I choose backfilling after backfilling I will choose columns repair 
Okay, so we have linked now substructure with superstructure. This is only an example. There can be ground floor. And also after a slab concrete for the first floor, I will link it with the column zero bar for second floor. So control click on column rebar, link activities. Okay, and for finishes, I will add just some few activities like block work, plaster work, and paint work. I will have block work six days, plaster ten days, and paint work six days. So if I want to link all of them, finish to start relationships, I can click shift on my keyboard and select all, right click, link activities. So they are all linked now. Block work to plaster to paint work. There is also another type of copying you would use in Promavera. Not only copying activities, but you copy the WBS with the activities underneath. So let's assume, let's delete the second floor WBS, which doesn't have any activity here. So I will click delete. And I want to create the second floor WBS. So you don't have to create the WBS separately before you copy activities. You can do it right away. So I will copy the whole WBS, click copy and go to finishes because I want to have the same level for first floor and second floor and click paste yes I want to also copy activities click OK and you would need to rename it into second floor and you want to uh, organize it down below the first floor go to activities again and now you have all activities copied under this WBS. Let's have a predecessor for the block work of the first floor. Let's say that after the slab concrete for second floor, I will start the finishes. Of course, you would have more floors and more finishing activities, but I'm just trying to explain the copying formulas. And let's link also the key milestones for foundation. So start foundation. This is a start milestone so you can have it start to start relationship with the excavation work and also this is a completion of the foundation so it will have two successors the column rebar for construction activities and also i want to link it with the start of with the completion of foundation so this is a milestone finish milestone click run schedule Okay, we will just delete the engineering work. Let's focus on construction work in this example. So now we have very few activities regarding construction and the finishes. In the next lecture, we will talk about the formatting tools, grouping and sorting.